Three, two, one, action. My name is Curtis Ryan Woodside. I'm a filmmaker and Egyptologist from South Africa. I will be making my move to Italy permanent, where I will be living with Filippo, after more than a year and a half of not being able to get back. Gigi Lamoroso. I have visited Tuscany a couple times before, but this time it's a little different. Now it's about settling in. So come with me on something that I don't usually do, a vlog, and see what we get up to almost every week. station now um, to start going to Naples. Yeah. Napoli we're performing in an opera. Yeah. So should be a lot of fun. <laughs> I hope so. Just before we get on the train for Melania to take us there, uh, we're stopping to take the dogs for a walk. But look at these roses. <laughs> We have three hours on the train to Napoli, so I edited a little bit of my Egyptian Secrets at the Vatican documentary, which is now on YouTube. Filippo has gone off to San Carlo Theatre to do his rehearsal for Carmen and I am going back to, we've rented a little apartment just off the main street um, but it's quite a walk to get there but anyway at least we have our own space um, which is nice we've stayed there a month before so yeah <sighs> It's definitely a lot cooler here than it is in Firenze, but it's interesting to be back in Naples, Napoli after a long time. So everybody, welcome to our little apartment here in Napoli. It's quite small, but it does the job that we need for the short amount of time that we're here. And we have two of our own balconies with a really nice view onto a typical Italian scene. <laughs> so you see this view throughout Italy, but it's quite beautiful in its own way. a very long train ride. <sighs> Good night. <laughs> Okay, so you thought we were gonna get like three small desserts, right? Just to taste it. And what did we get? Three huge desserts. We have cannolo scomposto. This is cannolo scomposto. Uh -huh. Scomposto means like deconstructed. Deconstructed. Um, 
I'm not quite sure what that is. I think this is this is I know I don't know. Milfoil and see um, milfoil or cheesecake, yeah, cheesecake. This is where the open air opera that Filippo is performing in Carmen will take place. Of course, I had to see the ancient Egyptian replica sphinxes of Pharaoh Nectanebo, which are now in Napoli. Filippo is here to sing, and I'm here to film a documentary in the shadow of Mount Vesuvius at Pompeii. Are you happy? Si. Buon appetito, Filippo. Buon appetito, mangiamo. Authentic Napolitano pizza. This is the strangest thing. It's a Michael Jackson food van kind of thing. I don't think Michael has ever been to Napoli, but I think he definitely would have approved. I have just finished shooting at Pompeii. I have been here for I don't know how many hours. I arrived at like half past ten, and the time now is huh, seven o'clock. So I am going home. But for those of you who want to see the whole documentary we shot at Pompeii, you can watch it on my YouTube channel soon. So that won't be part of the vlog. Anyway, oh, now for an hour ride back on the train. Oh, as you can tell, I'm exhausted. This is what a filmmaker's feet look like after eight hours of standing at Pompeii. On the bright side, I did get to meet my friend Alex, uh, who is an archaeologist who also works here at Pompeii. Um, and he was actually born in the modern village of Pompeii, so it was great for him to show us around. Um, so that is also part of the documentary. Now, back to Napoli. So I'm going to include just a little preview of the Pompeii documentary for you here on the vlog. Make sure to check back on my YouTube for when it's up. This is Pompeii, an ancient city practically frozen in time. It is so unique that walking on the streets here makes you feel transported back almost 2,000 years ago to when it was one of the most populous cities in the ancient Roman Empire, not only for people from Italy, but also the Greeks, and even as far as Egypt. As an Egyptologist and a history lover, I want to see what links there are between Pompeii and Egypt. And trust me, there are quite a few. We must be crazy because the next day we went back for the third time to our favorite restaurant in Napoli. Grazie. Quanto tempo vi trasferite a Napoli? No, 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 sì, ma sono già passati. In tutto nove giorni, ma partiamo lunedì mattina. Mi sono a cantare qua a casa. 
fa il San Carlo? Mm. Che cos'è? Contratto, baritono, tenore, bello. Ah sì, giusto. Lei è venuto anche prima del primo lockdown. Io sono venuto avvisato. tante volte. <ride> sono cinque anni. Ciao. Ciao. This is Filiberto, he is one of Filippo's students, so he's come to watch Filippo in opera. Anyway, so it's the general rehearsal tonight, so... Yes. Yes. We'll have like 37 degrees. <laughs> yes, it's very hot, yeah. but... There's always something Egyptian hiding around the corner. We are San Carlos. San Carlos, sì. This is actually a rehearsal that's happening right now, a uh, dress rehearsal, and they actually sell tickets for audience to watch, even though the opening night is two nights away. So, because this was sold out quite a while in advance, I could not get a ticket to the show. So at least I get to see the dress rehearsal. Um, but we're a little early, we've just seen Filippo, um, so we're just gonna wait for the audience, and then showtime.
A dopo. A dopo. A dopo. Bye good, bye. Ha, good luck for the second half. Ciao. Ciao. Andiamo. Andiamo. Scusa. Ma si può? Andiamo. joys of doing outdoor concerts.
ce que je veux.
The museum in Naples has a beautiful coffee shop, which I have to commend it on. So we've just finished filming at the Museo Archeologico di Napoli, um, filming all the Egyptian things connected to Pompeii there to go in the documentary. So, grazie Fili. Prego. Per mi aiuto. Prego. Anche te Filiberto, grazie. Ciao. Thanks for them for being patient with me. But I said we would finish at two and we did. So I'm on time, right? Oh, so Diana Psaxo, every squall. Va bene, mangiamo. Mangiamo la pizza. Sì, alla mare. My pizza is actually bigger than the plate. Piace. Around the center of the Galleria in Napoli are depictions of four different civilizations, including Egypt, with Queen Nefertari. I am now backstage waiting for the show to finish so we can all go to dinner together. Um, so it's a premiere night, obviously. Um, I guess it sold out, couldn't get tickets, but I get to hear it from backstage. We'll be going to dinner in a little bit, it's almost midnight. A little tired. I'll fix it. Anyway, this is my friend Jenna. She's married to Brian, the tenor from Carmen. They're over there. <laughs> She's from America, so it's so nice to actually speak to someone who speaks English. <laughs> it's refreshing. It is, it is. So we're going to get some more gin and tonic and desserts. Yes. So, bye. <laughs> Really? Okay, fine. We, it's 2.30 in the morning and we are going to have a walk to Mergellina. Yes, with the other singers. With the other colleagues. Si. <laughs> All <laughs> drunks. Yeah. All drunks. But you don't see me. Ah. Wait, I'm here. Nice, Hello, nice. now you see me. <laughs> Ciao. <laughs> I would like to give a big thank you to my patrons for not only supporting my Egyptology work, but my filmmaking in general. And thank you to all of you for watching and supporting my videos.